people, and welcome to Tears of the Kingdom Tips and Tricks, as well as a Shrine Tutorial. We're here at the North Lomai Labyrinth in the Hebra Mountains. This is kind of a twofer, so there's going to be two videos that deal with the North Lomai Ruins. Uh, this first one will deal specifically with the Labyrinth, and then after that we'll talk about the Castle and the Depths in the next one. So, to start, when you get to the labyrinth, you can read this little table, and this guy basically decided to go do some research in there, and what he did was, is he walked in and he left a trail of pine cones for you. So, go ahead and grab those pine cones as you go, and just follow his trail. He also has some flint left there for fires. Um, there is a lot of gloom in this area, and you can try to climb around it, or you could just be like me and just run through it. As you can see, that is the goal there, to get to that shrine, and if you follow the trail of pine cones, you will make it there. Um, so, not super difficult as long as you follow the pine cones. When you get to this section, you might want to start some fires and get rid of some of this ice. There is a treasure chest under all that rubble there. Um, so as you can see, I'm going to use a fire fruit and melt some of the ice, and then lift the, the boulders out of the way once they start to fall. And let's see here, the treasure chest is a Zonite bow. Sweet, 30 power, not bad. You can get rid of that soldier's bow then.
to the next corner of the maze, you're going to find a similar situation where we can get a chest. So this time, instead of using fire flowers, I'm just going to use some flint and wood. And we're going to melt that down to get to the chest. And the chest contains a mighty Zonite shield, so that's pretty sweet. Get rid of my dumb Boko one. All right, finally we made it to the center, and as you can see, there is a thing to the depths here. Um, we'll have to get back to that later. First of all, we're going to need to melt this ice. So to do that, we'll once again get our flint and wood out. takes a while for the ice to melt. You can use those little ice chunks to make ice weapons, by the way, in case that's something you're interested in. And there we go. So here we are at the Mayo Taki Shrine. Hello, welcome to Tears of the Kingdom Shrine Tutorials. Here is the Mayotaki Shrine in the middle of the North Lomai Labyrinth. Alright, thanks to the quote-unquote difficulty, this is a Ra-Ru blessing. So you can go ahead and grab your item and solve the shrine.
All right, once you exit, you're going to see this little circle that you can activate. You're going to want to press it. Since you've conquered the labyrinth, the ruler of owls has unlocked a door. That door is above us in the sky labyrinth. So we're going to have to get up there, and that will be in another video. One last thing you might want to do in the uh, labyrinth here is right above where the shrine is, there's actually another chest. Um, to do that, to get up there, you're going to want to use Ascend. And if you ascend up, you're all be on a little platform here where um, your bud has another note. You can read that if you want. It's about him finding stuff. He's really excited about it, blah, blah, blah. Uh, but if you go to the right then, or no, if you go back up one more time, you can see there's another little level above us. And on that level is a treasure chest. Boop -ba -doo -doo. And we can open that up. And a big battery. Nice. All right. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the skies.